オープンザツインゲート統一タッグ選手権試合チャンピオン石田海斗カズマ坂本 VS チャレンジャー横須賀進むキング清水Representing Natural Vibes. Sumi Yokosuka, and the newest member of Natural Vibes, a guy who was、uh, very different at the last Kobe Pro Wrestling Festival. It was very, very different at the Kobe Pro Wrestling Festival before that. Perhaps he has finally settled in on a, on a persona that works for him, King Shimizu. Just a year ago, he was Big R Shimizu. Then he was once again Ryotsu Shimizu. Then he was Boku R Shimizu. Then he was Boktomo Dragon. And now he is the King of Kings. And Natural Vibes, when he lost his mask, Natural Vibes was the unit that came out to make the save for him. And shall we dance, Dragon Gate Network fans? Here we go! Everything changes when the glasses go on. Champions, the 32nd. I、oh、know. I'm sorry. The 52nd. Open the Twin Gate Champions. This will be their first attempt, attempt at defending the championship since winning them back on May 5th at Dead or Alive 2021 from Masaki Mochizuki and Takashi Yoshida. It's Kaito Ishida and Kazuma Sakamoto. One of the most deadly and dangerous Open the Twin Gate champion teams I've ever seen. The way these two complement each other. Kazma said it last night at the contract signing that Kaito Ishida may be the best partner he's ever had. The best. And you know, considering the career that he's had, it's taken him all over the world. He's teamed with such a huge variety. And his career took him from. A shack in Puerto Rico, all the way up to Monday Night Raw, and all, all the all the different stops you can make in between. He's done it. And this is going to be Tomiko-san from Office Hatano, another one of our longtime partners. Reading the, de the declaration.
Well, Kaz been giving the stink eye to Tomiko. <laughs> Very resounding <laughs> round of applause from Kazma. And now the champions will pass over their champion championship belts. And we will pause for pictures and screenshots. Natural Vibes earned this championship match. There was a three-way six-man back in Kobe Sambo Hall at the end of June at Kazma and Kaito, along with Eita against a King Shimizu Sumu Yokosuka natural vi led Natural Vibes team. Shimizu got the pin on Kaito in that match, which by all rights a pin over the champion, earns you a shot at the championship. However, after that, the Natural Vibes team was eliminated by Benke, uh, Benke led natural or high end team. So because of the order, the direct win over the champions got the Natural Vibes team the first shot. And then for tomorrow. And then tomorrow it'll be it'll be Benkei and Dragon Kid. Twenty-eight years old, 2013 debut, the King of Kings. King Shimizu. Someone else has that nickname, but we'll use it for him. The technical master. One of the Torimon Originals, part of the second graduating class of the Ultimo Dragon Gym, Susumu Yokosuka. Kazuma Sakamoto, El Desperado. He came to Dragon Gate for the first time in 2018 as a surprise member of R.E.D. And never stopped kicking. Still only 25 years old, Kaito Ishida. And the challenger team were re was ready for the flying start, and we are going to go. Susumu Whoa. takes to the skies here What's in the opening idea? moments. Is he going to? Shimizu. Shimizu. Whoa. Shimizu with a rolling senton of his own. Never seen Rikishi do that. No. He's going to do one more. Nobody, Nobody home. home for the king press off the apron. Oh no, Kazma! <laughs> this power bomb Susumu right on top of his partner. That's what I was talking about. This team being so dangerous. It's a quick start. As they snuffed out the rally from Natural Vibes just like that. And Kazma said yesterday, you know, normally when. Uh, you know, someone with his experience, you know, his age, when, you know, when you team with someone at, at Kaito's, you know, his career level and his age, you know, here, you know, the senpai kohai relationship here in Japan is usually, you know, the, the, younger, the younger team member is going to do whatever the veteran says. But what he likes about Kaito, you know, Ishida is very quick to make his own suggestions and say, hey, no, maybe why don't we do it this way? And on the other side, Ishida, you know, the experience and everything that Kazma has seen in his career allows him to bring a new perspective. You know, when you, you, know, you wrestle here in Dragon Gate, the Dragon Gate style, you know, you're, you're used to the speed, you're used to the pace here. Kazma bringing, you know, able to give Ishida advice and, you know, maybe how to do some, th some things different to keep, to keep his opponents off balance. You know, this pairing has ended up being incredibly beneficial for, for both Kazma and Ishida. And it bore fruit, bore fruit very quickly as they captured the Open the Twin Gate Championship only a few weeks after forming this team. A lot of Twin Gate Championship history in this match. Shimizu held the championship several times as a part of the team that was called uh, Big E with Eita. Kazuo Sakamoto also held the championships with BB Hulk and Susumu, a mainstay of the Open the Twin Gate Championship. The tag team seen here, one of the founding fathers of the Twin Gate division, his teams with Ryo Saito, with Kuness, with Kage Tora. 
Ooh. Uh, that's, why, that's why they call him just a kick boy. The Tokyo Revenger style hair. Oh. <laughs> That's got shot. Savat kick right to the midsection. Ishida won his first championship here in Dragon Gate. They opened the Brave Gate by with a pinfall win over Susumu Yokosuka. So he knows what it takes to beat him on a big stage like this. as it has been all R.E.D. since that, that opening flurry from the Natural Vibes side. <laughs> Kazma can punish his opponents in, uh, you, you pick, a, pick a methodology, whether it, just, whether it be striking, whether it be submission work, whether it be power, you know, <laughs> however he feels in the morning, that's the way Kazma, but the, the the foundation is he he got to know all. He got to know everything before, you know, he can pick a strategy into the match. Yeah, he's able. And that's something that's going to help this team, his ability to you know, read, read the opponents and put together a game plan. And they've executed it to perfection so far because it has been all R.E.D. here in this Open the Twin Gate Championship match. Oh. He's a, almost, well, I was like lackadaisical in his, in his pace, but every single kick. Oh. And finally, Susumu fights back with the exploder, but. Packed in, and in comes the King of Kings. A house of fire, King Shimizu. Ooh. His time as Bokutomo Dragon, people were wondering when we were gonna get the old Shimizu back, the power fighter, the one that's able to do that, pick up Kazuma Sakamoto with ease. And then cr crunch them both together in the corner. Oh. Uh -oh. Watch the, the, the unbel carry. unbelievable feat of strength. Bows of the uh, champion team. He has got, I mean, Kazma alone. <laughs> but but you add Ishida as the extra Samoan drop out of the corner, and he's just saying it was easy, or too easy, as someone that used to wrestle here used to say. And now Natural Vibes zeroing in on Kaito Ishida. Ooh. Jumbo Lariat, and before Susumu even had the chance to move out of the way. Shimizu, what is he? Whoa. Whoa, he German <laughs> suplex into an exploiter. German suplex, German suplex is his own partner. And well, Horiguchi <laughs> saying, if you think you can do it, your, uh, do it on your own, that was a good strategy, so let's see. Powerbomb and Ishida manages to counter with a Hurricane Rana. Oh. <laughs> Kick right into the jumbo, and <laughs> again. Who's hurt more? I don't know. <laughs> no idea. Ooh. She puts an end to that with the NZ Gary, but he runs right into Jumbo Lariat. Almost takes his head off. All the way from the top now. Top rope. 
from the bright lights. Super Exploder dumps Ishida. And throw a little party before the splash. Kazuma in to save the championships. Palm strike catches Shimizu. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <Kick> <laughs> Asks Shimizu to wait. Wait a second, and he was happy to comply. And <laughs> huge flurry of strikes only gets a two count for Kazma, but he smells blood in the water. A tense, tense strikes in succession by the champions, but Shimizu all takes his one lariat, I guess. Ooh. Duck it. Susumu Jumbo. Dash middle from Ishida, and all four competitors are down in this Open the Twin Gate Championship match. Who's gonna get up first? Kasma. System we're gonna roll to the floor. Champion team gets up first. Let's see if they can move in and zero in on Shimizu. Well, Shimizu fights his way out of it, but Ishida gets out of the way and again. What a, a hell of a load to get up for a Michinoku driver, but he does it. We're only 10 minutes in and we got Kobe World Hall is the scene of a homicide. I can't believe we're only 10 minutes in. There's been so much action in this match. He's thinking to and, oh, and The clock has struck. It almost gets him. Signaling for the finish, maybe half package pile driver time. The most dangerous moves in Dragon Gate. No one has kicked out of this. Sumu fights his way out, Ooh. runs a high kick, German suplex. God, the teamwork from the champion team is just unbelievable. And there's the ankle lock. Essentially, the combination they used to win the championships. And I don't, I don't know where Shimizu is, but Susumu is in, in the middle of the ring. He's got no place to go. Got the rope. Oh, ah. Ishida drags him back in and sinks it in. And Kazma has got Shimizu in a sleeper. He's going to have to carry Kazma on his back. <laughs> That's exactly what he's doing. Oh. Standing King Splash breaks up the ankle lock and saves this challenge for Natural Vibes. Catches the knee strike, but not that one. Sky high choke slam. And Ishida runs in to make the save again. It pop up into Jumbo for the win. Ishida is out. There's a chance for Shimizu. It's Olympic time. Let's throw the shot put. Ooh, ooh. Shot put ah. slam and Ishida, or Kasma, sorry, slips ah. out of box from SBK. And that's, uh, an RED match was eventually going to turn into this. One knee strike and a second. That could be 
Oh, no, she oh, oh, kicks out. out. I thought that was it. Natural vibe, C Miss still alive. Ooh. Turns in. Now, shot, put, slam, oh. connects. Oh. He got it. He doesn't go for the cover though. Where's he going? Jumbo area takes out Ishida. King Splash connects! New champions! Natural Vibes did it! King Shimizu! Paying dividends for Natural Vibes, we've got new champions! And Natural Vibes! That's 2-0 and o for them now. We got a new champion that's, right an hour ago with uh, Horiguchi, and that's now not, we got the twin gate champion. Well, that's, uh, signs are, it bodes well for KZ, but I'm shocked. You know, going into this, I thought that if any of the champions had the best chance to run the table this weekend, it was gonna be Kazuma and Kaito. Well, fact is the fact that we got a new champion here. That's 53rd. Open the Twin Gate champions are crowned. It is King Shimizu and Susumu Yokosuka. And don't forget, Susumu Yokosuka have been Twin Gate champions so how many times? Actually, I have to take count on that. I mean, that's his fifth or sixth reign, I think. With different kind of partners, you see. That's you see, he's the one who is the most experienced within this match. That's a f fourth you know? different partner. With all the white powder on the face, Shimizu. Yeah, King Shimizu. Despite the efforts of R.E.D., that's a hell of a, it's gotta feel good for Shimizu after he was kicked out of R.E.D. back in September. That sent him on that path to- This can be know, a very, where, really, uh, revenge. Where he lost himself. I think he has found a home and he has found an identity. And that is as one half of the Open the Twin Gate champions. The seventh reign for Susumu as Open the Twin Gate champion with his fourth different partner, King Shimizu, Jimmy Kage Tora. Or just Kage Tora, Kunas, Rio Saito. We are heading to a all natural vibes versus high end all out war tomorrow night. It's going to be Kage Tora against Kinki Horiguchi, and then these two, Susumu Yokosuka, King Shimizu, will be facing the team of Benkei and Dragon Kid. Don't miss it. Main event coming next is also still got a challenger from uh, Natural Pride. Can Natural Vibes, can KZ do it? Can KZ time arrive? I have to say that that's a huge upset. New champion. The new champions take one more bow. And as they are dis disinfecting the ring, getting the powder out of there. It's main event time.